News 13's Brittany Bate is here with what we know so far. Brittany. Lizzie, a very active scene in Las Cruces right now. We do know there was a shootout on I-10, and that is where the chase ended and the suspect was killed. But it is not clear where or how this all began. And again, we do want to warn you, this video is graphic. Watch out, watch out! The video you just watched was recorded around 1 this afternoon on I-10 in the heart of Las Cruces. Instagram video of the shooting begins by showing a white pickup truck being pushed backwards down I-10 by a single police unit, with several other units following close behind. The video is too graphic to play in its entirety, but right now we are showing you a live look over the scene on I-10. We can also tell you what the video shows happens next. You can then see the suspect get out of the truck, walk straight up to the hood of the cruiser and start firing. You can hear at least a dozen shots exchanged between the suspect and police. After the gunshots stop, you can see officers walk over to the suspect and they appear to kick the gun away from him. Right now, it is not clear where this chase began, what led up to it or how many agencies are involved. I-10 is closed from University Avenue to West Picacho Avenue and police are expected to be on scene for several hours. We do know the New Mexico State Police Chief is on his way to Las Cruces and we are expecting an update from Chief Tim Johnson at some point tonight. Lizzie, back okay, to you. Okay, Brittany, and we have a crew on the way as well and we'll bring you more information as soon as we get it on air and online at alwaysonkrqe.com.